Here's the first look of our hatchlings, which were born about three or four days ago. And we have 14 in total. Right now we have them in a 20 long, just for now, until they get a little bigger. And we're gonna have a whole setup for these guys and will soon be for sale so this batch was actually unexpected we had two baby bearded dragons grow up um, in one single tank and they happen to be male and female and this is what they created these beautiful babies so we have three leather backs. No, excuse me. We have three silk backs, which that one that's in the bright red is a silk back. And the rest of the guys are leather backs. We have some that are hypo. And as you can see. These babies are very colorful and beautiful. Right now they're all doing good. They're all eating. They're all enjoying the bath, the basking spot. Just finished taking a nice little bath. But they're doing very good. Overall, we're going to start our own little website or slash webpage and start selling these bad boys or girls but price ranges not yet determined overall I'm very happy of what came out from these beautiful dragons the father of these pairs is a hypo translucent American leatherback very beautiful male and I will be showing them very soon, which was where they got the red from. But this is probably the most brightest and probably our prize of all this silk back, which is very beautiful, has nice patterns. As you can see, very silky skin. I know a lot of people are gonna say, um, silkies are not popular in the game, but I love all of them the same, it does not matter. And as you can see, all the regular leather backs. These are all siblings. So if anybody's looking to buy any, if you buy a pair, you cannot breed them. And I highly recommend never breeding silk back mount, I'm um, silk back, silk back dragons, excuse me. Definitely think it's a little cruel based on the no scalations on the body but um we got a couple I think this guy right here might be a hypo got the clear nails just none of them came out with their daddy's black eyes but overall very happy and healthy bearded dragons Shh, the mother gave us a total of what babe I think 20 and out the 20 eggs, 14 of them made it through. Um, during the process of the mother laying the eggs and trying to bury them back up, she happened to pop two eggs and the rest just did not make it throughout the incubation period. But now let's get to the parents, which is just over. I have the piece of paper there blocking so they don't see the mother the father so this is the mother very beautiful she's the leather back also which is why we produce um, some silk backs as you can see she has very beautiful colors on her very orangey orangey hey baby this is Bentley. 
She got her name Bentley because we originally thought she was gonna she was a male. But in time found out that um she was a female and that name just stuck on her. Don't know why she has stress spots. Find that very weird. Usually very happy and upbeat. And that's her 40 gallon breeder. And over to the right is the main man. A hypo translucent leather back. And this is Jax. And Jax is a um, very tough guy here. Very beautiful. Have beautiful colors on them. And he's the guy that got her knocked up. Let me see if I could get a better visual on how his skin scales are. All my dragons are very well taken care of. All very loved dearly. And they all have 40 gallon breeders. Very clean tanks. The only reason why I have the mother in San is because after she gave birth to these little guys, she a month later wound up giving me another batch of eggs. So waiting for another month period pass. If she doesn't have any more eggs, then the sand will be removed and copper will be added. And this is our eldest peanut. And he's a straight bad boy. He's about almost 300 grams, if I'm not mistaken. Very good. He has a special hammock. He even has his own bed with pillows and everything. This guy spoiled. My fiance spoils him. And we're gonna move on over to my other female tank, which is this big girl. Phoenix. She's a very beautiful bearded dragon, beautiful colors. She's just big and lazy and just chills. And this is Butter. Another, another big girl. Keep the two females together. And the only reason why I got Bentley separate is because she was pregnant at the time. Hey, Bentley. Oh, that's just so annoying, babe. Anyway, that's the end of the video. Dragons will be up for sale. Please contact me. Comment on the video. In about a month or so, we will have listings of the prices on each bearded dragon. We'll have length, weight, and all possibilities of delivery options that we may have for them as of right now we're located in New York and we're willing to do local deliveries for a small delivery charge and anything out of state we'll have to discuss either on the phone or via email very beautiful colors on these bearded dragons one last look very pretty All right, we're out.